All right, welcome back. I'm just gonna... I, this is what I mean, though. This is a perfect example of what I mean. You can't hit start to just leave the start menu. You have to hit the circle Sir. button to return to game. Why? why? Yeah, why? why? There's no reason for that. It's it's the little shit in this game. Like, everything they did right, they missed all the little shit. You know what I mean? That makes no... That, like, that's just a simple little, the, like... Why? There's a reason why I think the original version of this game is better, and it's because they didn't miss a little shit. I love that Mermaid Man is an old senile man who's losing his mind. Yeah. That Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! <laughs> massaging your feet. Love that one. I think I better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Here I come, Patrick! <laughs> <laughs> By clipping my toenails? This game is treat. Ah, uh, yes. The slide. Ooh, I is already can tell I don't like how this operates. Weird. It, it does not control at all like it used to. It's both too fast and too slow. Hey, hey. You got it. Hey, I actually got that. That was not bad for the fact that I was like, oh yeah, shit, I gotta go to the left. Or the right. All right, <laughs> I gotta go one direction. I gotta go to the other. <laughs> yeah, the slide is weird. Oh, you need to help Patrick, but he's unreachable. Maybe there's a switch to create a way. The robots are guarding them heavily. You'll have to battle through early. You'll have to battle thoroughly. Oh, there's a part of me that wants to try and make that jump too, but I know I won't make it. Because <laughs> you could do that in the original game. Uh, I don't know I don't if you could, but... I remember. Yes, I don't know if you could, but... <laughs> I need you to take a hit. <laughs> nice, Derek. <laughs> nice, nice. <laughs> fucking hell yeah. I'm such a funny guy, yeah. Hell yeah, fucking. <laughs> I made a joke about weed. <laughs> fucking hell yeah, dude. <laughs> I'm so funny. I'm, as the hip and cool kids say, I am. lit. <laughs> as those hip young people put it, I am. hip. hip, hip and lit. I am... I am lit litter? I'm, I'm litter. Ta-da! It shines! Um... Oh, yeah, the other way. I was like... I honestly forgot I was like, where did the path open up to? <laughs> Hi, Spongebob! Hi, Patrick! Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robots and the. Oh yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it looks important. Thanks, Patrick. <laughs> I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. Okay. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! All right, we're back in the fray. There was no time that passed outside of this, I assure you. There was you. no food consumed either. Yes, yeah, absolutely none. How many of these do I have to carry? I All like that of he can them talk Patrick. to us telepathically. <laughs> well, That's he's Patrick. <laughs> he's motherfucking Patrick Star. Motherfucking Patrick Star. Okay. So, um, this I don't think is a thing anymore. I'm pretty sure it was like one of the first things they patched. But originally, you could just do this, and they would increasingly grow and or shrink in size, depending if you were SpongeBob or Patrick. <laughs> and I wish they what? never. I wish they never patched it out because it was the funniest shit in the world. <laughs> and he turned into a pickle. Funniest shit I've ever seen. Oh, that's so dumb. Yeah, it was. Uh, it was something, all right. Because <laughs> you could do it infinitely. There was no cap. And the guy would grow, or you would grow? They would grow. They, they, this guy would grow. I would just do this, and they would just this grow infinitely forever. That is so amazing. Hey, 
Which way you going? Hello. He's talking to me. Okay, I am at your command. I love how expressive they are. That's great. Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. <laughs> Relatable. Instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Perfect. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low quality design and knock off wallets. <laughs> oh, thank you. <clears throat> thank you. I too wish to make well quality knockoff wallets. Low quality, not well quality, Chris. <laughs> yeah, low quality knockoff wallets. Of course. I'd have nothing else. Also, I don't remember this cave at all. You don't remember this? I actually do remember this. I remember it being very dark and not being able to see anything. Yeah, that's more accurate to how it was. <laughs> it's, it's like, yeah, no, that's just how it actually was. Bing, bang, boop. Wow, that was a combo b b b breaker. C -c 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 combo breaker. I'd say we should play that, but they're only on the Xbox now, and I don't fucking own an Xbox. I can't grab that ledge either, apparently. What game is that from? Oh, you don't know? That's a uh, uh, Killer Instinct. That's what I saw. God damn it. That's Killer Instinct, otherwise known as not Mortal Kombat. Uh. It's the Mortal Kombat game that isn't Mortal Kombat. Because all their characters are stolen straight from Mortal Kombat. No, they're not. You're lying to me. No, if I was lying to you, I would say it was a completely original game with nothing stolen whatsoever. No. No. Yes. <laughs> yes. Why did I pull this over here? I don't think I, I needed don't know. to. I think it was solely to get that. Oh, good. Well, hello, okay. camera. Okay. If you insist. Interestingly enough, the camera is finnier, finny, finnier, finnier than I remember it being when I played it on the Switch. I actually don't remember having all that many camera problems. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, excuse me? Can we talk about this first? <laughs> no. Apparently no, we cannot talk about anything. Oh my god, your super monster combo! Super monster, monster combo! Breaker. <laughs> super Omega Monster Combo. Oh yeah. Now remember, Chris, you can use the melons as a platform. Wow, that's so great. I'm so happy they told me this. Who are now, you and how did you get in Now remember house? to stack the melons. Stack the melons. Melon, the snack. M -m 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 melon Lord. I am the Melon Lord! That's probably too far away. <laughs> nah, I think you can do it. Not if I can't actually jump on it. There we go. <laughs> I told you you could do it. Yeah, I believed you. I believe you and had no reason not to, Derek. <laughs> I said that to somebody <laughs> yesterday. And yeah. I was just like, yeah, my buddy likes to do that to people. <laughs> and then they're like, stop it. Stop it! <laughs> Ouch. It's a, I mean, it's an amazing statement. Nothing yes. makes people more, like, self-contained in fear than telling them that you believe them and have no reason not to believe them. Because they don't believe you actually believe yes, them. Yes, because then they immediately panic and assume you don't believe them. <laughs> he feels slower now. I mean, we are on ice. Well, I remember him being really fucking fast when yeah, Sonic it, Speed the, when he was in the game. I honestly do feel like they toned down the movement speed in this game. Like, just a tad. It's like just enough to be noticeable. <laughs> <That's much better. gasps> Destroy the ham wars. Ham or. Uh, ah. Oh, what am I doing? I don't know. I, I need to do this. Oh, wait. No, this? No. Oh, shit. Am I thinking the wrong game? 
Oh. I think that might have only been on the... I think you need to go get the melon. Yeah, I think that might have been the other one. Dude, I need you guys to chill the fuck out. Yeah, I guess so. Wait, no. That was it. Oh! Okay, I got this. I have to double jump. And I can't land on top of them. Man, these guys really gotta chill out with their hammers. Ah! Uh... Oh, Alright, I got a cutscene while it's blown up, which means it cannot hurt me. I'm invincible during cutscenes. I'm a god man! <laughs> I'm a video game character. I'm invincible during cutscenes. <laughs> Unless I actually get injured in the cutscene. <laughs> Have you ever seen the video of fucking... It's like Fallout, uh, new, uh, the fourth one. It's Fallout 4. Four. And he's like having a conversation with someone, and while he's in mid-conversation, the killer robot comes up and is just smacking him in the face repeatedly. <laughs> he's like talking oh, yeah. to him. <laughs> so funny. Good thing, too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. I hear that you can fight hey. him on top of Old Sport Mountain here. Go hook that beast, sailor. Oh boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what I can do. Okay, Homer. Homer! I don't know. I can't tell if he's, like, the actual voice of Mr. Krabs or not. I don't think so. He doesn't quite sound like Mr. Krabs, but at the same time, he doesn't sound like Homer Simpson like the last one did. <laughs> Actually, you look it up for me. Yeah. Look up very hydrated Mr. Krabs' voice actor. I will do that for you. Also, not because I was curious as well. Yeah, of course not. It's only because I have demanded it, and I am a primal being. <laughs> that you must follow at all times. What the fuck? How did it hit me? Good. My death was totally in vain. <laughs> okay. Let's try this again, but with less death. It's not the same. It's not <clears throat> Mr. Krabs. It's not Mr. Krabs? It's not Mr. Krabs. Is it the guy, though, who does the voice of, uh... Pat, uh, did you Homer Simpson, though, this time? Or is it a totally different guy? I'm not sure. We'll find out. This one goes boom. Hello, Patrick. I've got a job for you to do. Oh, boy. I found a golden spatula, but those robots out on the island stole it and threw it into the lake. If you can figure out how to get it back, oh. welcome to it. Show it up, Mrs. Puff. So it is this. It's actually, no, it is the guy from the original. It is. Yeah, from the original Battle for Bikini Bottom. I wonder if they recorded it or something. He sounds a lot better this time around. I doubt we'll be able to actually find that information out there. <laughs> they decided to keep the original voices from Battle of King Bottom. Oh god. <laughs> Supposedly, this is what THC said. Uh, THC ignored producer said. The voice work from the original was spectacular. The feedback was universal from fans. They wanted fans to recall the game that they knew and love and keep it nostalgia alive. So that's why they kept them. I mean, I mean, I mean, it is really good voice acting in this game. It's just the wrong voice actor for like it just sounds two wrong. characters. It just sounds weird. Yeah. So I guess it was the same. I don't know. He sounds different. Oh, now. Mr. Uh, Mermaid Man is also voiced by the guy who does Mr. Krabs. Yeah, I knew that. Did I not bring that up the first time? I don't know. Uh, maybe I didn't. Oh, 
god. I need you to chill the fuck out. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, the voice acting in this game is great. It's just yeah. solely Mr. Krabs and, uh... It throws me off. And, uh, Mermaid Man are not the actual voice actor. Yeah, I mean, not that it's a problem. It just throws me off. I feel like I should be switching to SpongeBob. Maybe I should talk to Mr. Krabs first. Mr. Krabs first. But... Nah. I don't even have a license! Oh, good! Then it was just another bad dream! Yeah, okay. Is he okay? Just my size. Just my size. Bang, bang, boop. And blow that shit up, too. Uh, yes. Get fucked. Get, as they say, get fucked, son. Get fucked, son. <laughs> I really need you to blow up from that, because I can't attack you <laughs> without blowing myself up. Derek, you've just met the Sponginator. Nice. Derek, you've just met the Sponginator. Oh, das. No, Ove is a different one. Oh, yes. I need you to chill, actually. Let's just... Now I need you to chill out. <laughs> so there was a lot... There was a, there's a scene in Spongebob where they're like, we, So we can't talk about Texas? Can't say anything bad about Texas? And, and they say a couple more things along that lines, right? Yeah. And it was just like, when they're talking about the Dallas Cowboys... <laughs> Ouch. I'm just like, oh boy. So you can't, we can't say anything bad about Texas? No, you can't say nothing bad about, about Texas. Texas. Well, can we say that shoes from Texas are dumb? No. You know what? I just, I don't care. Yeah, it's not worth it. <laughs> yeah, like who gives a shit? Not me. Can't go that way, How dare really. you try sequence break, Chris? <laughs> How dare you try and have fun in this video game? Invisible wall, place it now! This is not how we have fun! <laughs> You're not sticking to the schedule of predetermined things I allowed to be fun! <laughs> uh. <laughs> I just have certain sections in this game feel though, man. Mm. Yeah, I'm just gonna assume I can. <laughs> I saw it. I appreciated the gusto. I bet there's totally different secret breaks in this game though that weren't in the first game that they probably didn't fix because they weren't in the first game, so they just had no idea because clearly they didn't put a lot of time into fixing bugs in this game. <laughs> That's most studios nowadays, though. <laughs> now, a lot of studios have a lot of money behind bug testing. I was not in range of that. <laughs> no. No, you weren't. Can you really go over there? Oh, I'm supposed to get this way to get over there. I'm like, there's clearly a way I'm supposed to go to get back over here. What is it? <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, anything involving physics is weird. weird I can't, and janky. I can't even really describe it. It's something that you just have to like see for yourself, and you're like, yes. "Oh yeah, that didn't feel right." Yes, it did. Like, like that whole thing tilted down, and I was just—I literally had a moment where I was like, "Am I playing this game at all?" Like, it doesn't feel like I have any input over this. <laughs> Am I in a dream sequence? <laughs> you bitch. Oh yeah. Oh, but. But it didn't kill you. Yeah. Fuck you. 
You think you could kill me? All right, well, you win this round. I ain't going back. You win this round, Mr. Krabs. You win this round, invisible talking hand. Ah, yes, a long, a long boy. Aisle like device. A long boy. You call those long boys, Chris? From Why? I'm not 100% sure. I couldn't think of a single reason, honestly. It's a ham. Or, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Here I was thinking I'd have to go down there. Oh, good. You're so MLG pro. I will admit, I think the pull-up in this game is way stickier. Like, it just, you you just stick the things stick, to pull up stick, to them. Stick, sticky, 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 I'm so sticky. Yeah? Okay, I wasn't meant to have fun that way either. <laughs> oh, I have the wall jump, that's why. <laughs> yes. Here, let me tell you a little something about the wall jump. You jump on the wall, and then you mash the shit out of X, and it does it for you. X? Um, <laughs> I'd have nothing else in this game. There's a guy, um... Thank you for being able to jump in the air. <laughs> um, Several jumps! Uh, there's a guy called Nitro Rat. He does, like, video game reviews, and he does a lot of platformers, and mm -hmm. he's just like... Wall jumps are always so, like, poorly implemented in video games. Normally they're just automatic, and I'm just like, that's because wall jumps are, are kind of a pain in the ass to implement. <laughs> yes. In a way that isn't, like, that fucking mean. stupid. Because either you implement wall jumps as a mechanic to get to an area, or you implement wall jumps as, like, you can do it anywhere. And it becomes a problem when you do it that way. Yeah, like, Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> yeah, Kingdom Hearts, Mario games. Where I'm bouncing around 32 different times just to fly around. Mm-hmm. Oh, we're already at the boss. Do, 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 do. Underwear, underwear, underwear. They really expanded on this cutscene, by the way. Which I dig. The cutscene was originally way shorter. I thought the... His shield is down! Hit him! So... I'm gonna see if Slap I him again. If, I'm gonna see if I have the same feeling towards this that I did the first time. The first time I played him, I felt like the hit detection on this boss was weird. <laughs> Though this time around, I'm not really having an issue with it, so maybe I just was rusty the first time. You're getting rusty on me, Mr. Krabs. Yeah, that was not as hard as the first time I fought him, so maybe Dude, you got really jellyfish rusty. jam! Take this shit, I'm leaving. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye, have a beautiful time. That was the greatest thing ever. I've accomplished my mission. You got a jelly of jelly je jelly. I got je king jellyfish. Um, unfortunately, I think we're going to have to pick it up in the next part. We'll see you guys then. Peace. Peace.